The MicroStation Connect Edition User Interface. Continuing with our introduction to MicroStation, we find ourselves in need of becoming familiar with the basic layout, tool locations, and functionality found in the MicroStation Connect Edition. While working through the lessons in this course, you will learn, review the MicroStation Connect User Interface, access the backstage view, view file properties, ribbon search. Let's review the ribbon style user interface. The MicroStation Connect Edition features a ribbon style interface consisting of the following components. File tab, ribbon workflows, a quick access toolbar, button groups, ribbon buttons, dialog launchers, help tab, Contextual tabs, search ribbon, minimize, ribbon galleries. A knowledge of these components will be beneficial in your daily use of MicroStation. In the upper left corner of MicroStation, observe the active workflow, drawing. The MicroStation Connect Edition delivers five standard workflows. These include Drawing. This contains the most commonly used commands for creating, manipulating, and modifying basic elements such as lines, curves, polygons, and shapes. The task navigation workflow is used to navigate tasks. These were typically created in a previous version of MicroStation. The admin workflow is only visible when the active file is a configured DGN library. This provides access to administrative features such as text and dimension styles. The modeling workflow is only visible when in a 3D model. This contains tools used for creating, manipulating, and modifying 3D elements. The visualization workflow, which is also only visible when in a 3D model, provides access to lighting, materials, and rendering and animation tools that may be used when working with 3D geometry. You will also note the inclusion of the custom workflow, Myco ENG. MicroStation provides the ability to customize the user interface to include user-defined workflows that may include custom ribbon tabs, ribbon groups, tools, etc. Also included in the user interface is the quick access toolbar, an integrated ribbon search, and access to help. The Quick Access Toolbar contains frequently used commands such as Open, Save, and Print. With these tools being contained in Quick Access, they are available independent of the active workflow. The Ribbon Search is used to find tools or dialogs. It can be searched across multiple workflows and ribbon tabs, search help topics, and access the Bentley communities. To search, Enter the partial or full name of the tool or dialog and you will get a list of results with the given name in a window below the search field. The search results are categorized by first the ribbon, then the backstage view, and then the quick access toolbar. From the help tab, you can access help contents which opens the web help in your default web browser. On the Help Ribbon tab, you can also expect to see the following. Connect Advisor, Feedback Service, Examples, and Social Media Links. From the ribbon, pick File. You are presented with the Backstage View. The Backstage View contains many important features such as file operations, access to tools and settings, and more. There are many important MicroStation features found in this location. The following are a few examples. The Packager, which is used to create a workset package composed of design files, references, and workspace files. A Batch Converter, which is used to convert from one file format to another. Preferences, 
which allow you to set preferences and settings related to how MicroStation operates. You can publish an I model. This is used to convert a design file into a I.DGN file and package a set of design and reference files into a single protected file. And help, which is used to access the various types of help, such as connect advisor and product support. This is also the location where you can access the file properties. From here, pick Properties. Property dialog opens, displaying information related to the active design file, such as scale and lock properties. This same dialog is used to display many types of property information in MicroStation. Now, place your cursor over the title bar of the properties dialog. Press and hold the left mouse button and begin dragging the dialog. Observe the docking indicators that are displayed in the view window. Properties may be docked into the MicroStation interface on either the right or left sides of the application window. Drag and drop the dialog on the indicator shown on the left side of the interface. Once docked into the interface, the dock dialog may be resized as well as pinned. Take a few moments now and continue to review the properties in the properties dialog. Take note that multiple dialogs may be docked in the same docking region. In properties, locate workset properties. Here we can see the workset properties that are assigned to a design file associated with the active workset. These are the same properties that were viewed from the work page and may be used in annotation commands. Next, pick the file tab, again opening the backstage view. The backstage view contains many other tools and settings. Some are used to open additional toolboxes or provide access to printing and publishing features, while others allow you to optimize the way MicroStation operates. Take note that you should be careful. Making changes in certain areas of the backstage view can also affect other users. Contact your CAD management team for assistance. The next thing that we're going to do is select our preferences. So from here, pick Settings user preferences preferences dialog opens the user preferences are settings that control the operation of microstation in ways that are specific to the active user and do not affect other team members contained here are settings that control the mouse behavior allow you to change view related settings and more next Go ahead and select the input category and enable escape exits command. When this preference is activated, pressing the escape key will stop the current command. This is a convenient way of terminating the current command that you are working with. We will be using the escape key in this manner during the course. When finished, click OK to close the preferences and press the escape key to then return to the design canvas. Observe that MicroStation did not prompt to save changes to the preferences. While this is not true for all settings, preferences are saved automatically. This is similar to the behavior for changes made to the content of your drawing. Changes to geometry in the drawing are also automatically saved. Take note that changes made to other settings and properties may require you to exit and restart MicroStation to take effect. Go ahead now and close the design file topo-rd.dgn. During this lesson, you learned how to navigate the user interface in the MicroStation Connect Edition. It was seen that the MicroStation Connect Edition uses a ribbon style user interface. The backstage view was accessed and file properties were viewed as well as observed in the integrated ribbon search. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.